Hi friends, welcome back. This is Solomon Jagwe. I'm back with another quick insight. Uh, this time I'm going to be talking about a little bit of uh, Faceware Studio. So you've seen me do some tests in the, in the past where I've shown how you're able to stream from uh, Faceware Studio all the way to iClone. Well, today I'm doing a test in the Unreal Engine. So check it out. So this is a character. So this character is a, a character, th character, character creator three uh, model, and streaming straight into the Unreal Engine, and driven by a video. This is a uh, stock footage uh, by this uh, actor, and that is uh, the default Faceware Studio model. So the idea again is uh, to get your voice actor you know to record a video of, you, of themselves saying something uh linking it up and setting like a neutral pause in there and then streaming it into iclone using uh the live link the unreal live link okay and activating the the link and then sending it to the unreal engine so the character is there speaking <laughs> Isn't that impressive? So at least now I know that I, I have a pathway from Faceware Studio to iClone and then into uh, the Unreal Engine. So there is a, a plugin already that, uh, that Epic Games made where you can stream from your phone directly into the Unreal Engine. But uh, because I tend to do my animation in iClone, I love uh, the ability to be able to stream from Faceware Studio into iClone, then stream it directly into the Android engine. And it's actually pretty cool. I mean, look at that. As you see, the lips are moving. It's uh, definitely almost a one-to-one -one ratio, which is pretty, pretty cool. So guys, uh, I think coming up soon, if you have like a bunch of videos of your voice actors, uh, especially because of this pandemic, uh, if we are so far apart and we can't really meet in person, then it does help to be able to record someone from across the country, across the state, and then they send you the footage of their performance and you're able to stream it into iClone and then edit the mock-up if you want, do the props, the environment and setup. And because now the Unreal Engine, uh, the I Unreal Live Link from iClone includes props. So you're able to take the environment and uh, props into the Unreal Engine and then have your character set up. And then you can do your lighting to make it look really nice. And because of the CC shaders that uh, um, the like Real Illusion makes available, you're able to get the look and feel into the Unreal Engine. So that was my quick test today. Uh, thanks again, guys, for your support. Uh, don't Please don't forget to subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you're alerted when I post a new video. I'm going to continue to do more testing. And because uh, there's a short film that I'm working on that I, I'm trying, I'm relying heavily on the Unreal Live Link. I have sent my animation into uh, the Unreal Engine. So again, I do a lot of my motion capture acting here in, uh, in my <laughs> studio. And so uh, be, because I've gotten emails and requests from people across the world who might be interested in working with us uh having their video without without them having to be physically there is extremely extremely helpful you know i think this is gonna be this is like virtual acting in a way but i think this is a, an awesome thing to have especially with us as indie filmmakers and storytellers uh, having the ability to have someone from across the world, send you a video of their performance. Hopefully they have a very good audio connection so you have professional audio as well. And then being able to stream it into iClone, do your editing there, and then send the final animation to Unreal Engine. So looks like, I mean, I, right now it's actually streaming live. So you could essentially stream live. Like if you had like your uh, webcam on, you could stream that performance directly into iClone and then in iClone, sorry, in iClone and then into the Unreal Engine. And then in the Unreal Engine, you can then record the sequence. So 
that is my quick insight today and it's exciting it's an exciting exciting time to be alive as uh, storytellers and uh, filmmakers uh, thank you guys uh, see you next time with another insight and tutorial and uh, please uh, spare a minute to click like it helps out with the support of my the work that I'm trying to do to share my uh, skills that I'm picking up and any insight that I see that will benefit us as a storyteller so do please uh, hit that notification bell so you're alerted when I post a new video and subscribe if you're new to my channel I welcome you thank you so much for your support and see you next time bye for now